Hey everybody, welcome to I'm on a boat. <laughs> My name is Simone and this is George and this is where we watch film and You're television. On a boat. Which is good because this is move this movie is about ships. <laughs> Master and Commander, the far side of the world. The poster is just Half of it is just Russell Crowe's face on the top, and then the other half is I, I'm gonna is say a, a early 19th century ship. Okay. In some pretty rough waters, and then there's cannon fires. Are they pirates? Um, I don't think so because uh, I can kind of see Russell Crowe's characters like his collar. It looks navy. Oh, okay. It's got a stellar cast though. I was gonna ask just now. Yeah. So Russell Crowe, Paul Bettany's in this. Oh, I like him. And this person I did not expect, but I love him, mm -hmm. Billy Boyd. Oh. Yeah, Pippin's in this. Amazing. It's going to be really hard to not think of Pippin the entire time. It's true. You know, I, I, like, I, I don't think yeah. I've ever seen Billy Boyd right. in anything else, which is Me a too, travesty. Yeah, yeah I but only know him as Pippin. Before I press play, um, hey you, subscribe to our channel. Do it. Ooh. Jesus. Threatening. Ooh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, you better listen to the master. She's Ew. She's demanding. All right, let's do it. Do what you want, um, man. <laughs> <laughs> also, we have merch now. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that, that that's in, that's kind of important too, yeah. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> we should make a guess every time we start a movie. How many production companies will there be? Ooh, okay, I like that game. 3. Oh no, that's three, right? Okay, yeah, yeah. We'll see if there's more. I'm sticking with three. <laughs> I'm gonna lose. <laughs> <laughs> it's already doubting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it is three. Oh shit. Okay, April 1805. Napoleon is master of Europe. <laughs> Only the British fleet stands before him. Oceans are now battlefield. Whoa. <laughs> I'm just thinking, Gladiator was 2000. This mm -hmm. is 2003, so that means right after Gladiator, they went into production. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Is it going to be similar, Maximus? 28 guns, 197 souls, north coast of Brazil. Intercept French privateer. Sink, burn, or take her a prize. Oh. Oh, 197 people into a ship. The creaking was so like crisp in my ears. It like, literally felt like it was around my head. I mean, it is because I'm wearing headphones, but like, it was, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, those are the names of the cannons. Okay. <laughs> is that? Okay. That's interesting. Shift change. <laughs> I cannot imagine being crammed up with that many people in such a small space for so long. I mean, if you're like switching from like sleeping to like your shift. You're yeah, not always just, in the same place. It's just being surrounded by people all the time, mm. though. Like, so look at the size of that, right? A hundred and like two hundred people. Paul Bettany. I think. No, that wasn't <laughs> Paul Bettany. Wasn't it? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> that's definitely but that's Billy, Boyd. Billy Boyd. What is it, Slade? From an art summit. Sounded like a bell. Mr. Callamy, the lead, <laughs> if you please. Oh, hey, him. Hmm. He plays Octavian in. Uh, HBO's Rome, who grew up to be Augustus Caesar. Oh, should probably watch Rome one of these days. Mm-hmm. <laughs> there you go. Oh, it's gone. Yeah. That's creepy. Sound and broken shell. I wonder what that is code for. Two points off the stump. Should we beat the quarters? Oh, no. Nothing worse than being led by uncertain people. <laughs> Your officer of the, <laughs> the next thing he says is, I can't be certain. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just do we it. shall beat to quarters! Yeah, just be safe. Yeah. At best, nothing happens. At worst, everyone dies. You yeah. might as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah look at that. Yeah, people have to hunch around. To yeah, hunch that to would be around. the worst. It's so cramped. Yeah. Like, look how many people there are. Where away? Two points off the starboard bows. You sure, Mr. Hollum? Yes, sir. It was only for a moment. Uh, I, I thought I saw a shape. Did you see it, Mr. Callamy? No, sir. You did the right thing, Mr. Hollum. Go to your stations. Oh, man, the mist is so scary. Especially when you're, like, in it like this. Like, you can't see where you're mm -hmm. going. You get, like... Oh. Wait, why did they lose the smaller boats? Oh. There it is, cannon fire. Holy shit. Oh. Damage report, if you please. How did they know? 
Yeah. Because like if you can't see them, they can't see you, right? Exactly. But- I mean, they were making noise, so maybe. Boyle, up the colors. Engaged enemy frigate at six bells. Oh. Oh, fast. <laughs> Stand fast till she's close enough. Oh. Oh my god. Wow, okay, so their cannons are much better. Shoots much further. My only experience with like <laughs> cannon fodder is like Sea of Thieves. And this is so <laughs> much more destructive. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Maximus, no. Oh, okay, that's the ship that's they're the after. That's the one, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Aikion? I don't know how to say it. Um, yeah, that's why I didn't say it earlier. <laughs> I wasn't sure. The rather short away! Pull the gun crews to deck. Rig man ropes over the stern and pull the boats in. Pull for the boat wow! Meanwhile... <laughs> Yeah, everyone will want to do this because you die otherwise. Quiet, lads. No shouts, no calls. Wow. Yeah, this ship is oh, bare, barely floating. Oh man, and they just quietly, slowly. Even the creaking in the dark seems too loud. Mm-hmm. It sound really travels. Mm-hmm. Oh, this poor guy just... Yeah. They got it down a lot. Mm. He was like... Shoulder deep... Right? Before? Yeah. Well done, Mr. Lamb. Nine dead, 27 wounded. That's not Paul Benny. <laughs> what do you mean? It really sounded like him for a second. It was him. Really? Just the broken arms. I'm doing everything I can. I know you were close to his father. Damn, he was good. He came out of nowhere. And he slipped away because of the fog. Ah. Oh. Seven weeks sailing, and he happens in darkness. French have their spies in England and elsewhere. Oh, I love old maps like this. Yeah. It's so, cool. so cool and so incorrect sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, can you imagine like traveling on foot? Oh, yeah. And then trying yeah. to draw a map? Like, I know my map would be wrong, that's for sure. Mm-hmm. You have to wonder about the nature of a hull. She had the weather gauge and a clear advantage in fire. By comparison, the surprise oh my God. is a somewhat... Oh, can't even shit in peace. <laughs> Look at that hole, though. That's insane. The surprise is not old. She's a fine seabird. Weatherly, stiff, and fast. Oh, she's not old. She's in her prime. Oh. This... Basic repairs, we can get home as we are. We're not going home. We're going to the far side of the world. Hmm. We need a port, and the Acheron may be still looking for us. Acheron? Acheron. She is taking the war to the South Seas, and we are supposed to stop her. She's out of our class. She could be halfway to Cape Horn by the time we repaired and underway. Not a moment to lose. Jeez. Okay. Okay. Is it true about how they put the last stitch through your nose? Just mm. to make sure you're not asleep, not through the nose. You'll tell them. Apparently, doctors now rub the, the sternum really, really hard. Yeah. Because it hurts a lot. Oh, he yeah. did die. Nope. Oh, no, he's not. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was scared. I thought they were about to stitch him up. <laughs> oh, it's amputation. Oh, shit. Okay, well, my tooth pain from last week doesn't seem so bad now. <laughs> amputation without anesthesia is... Oh, my God. 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 Got a saw through the bone, too. Did he do it? Is that... I've never seen a braver patient. Oh. Oh! Wow. Not a scream. Yeah. Only two minutes to starboard four channel. I feel like Paul Bettany's character is a really good doctor because that, that didn't seem, you know, as bad as amputation is. That what was not no bad. <laughs> I think the movie just being nice to us. I appreciate it, movie. Thanks. Mr. Lamb, as always, will do his best. Okay. What are they doing? Oh, it's another surgery. Is it brain? That looks like a brain thing. Yep. <gasps> that thing is to, to cut open the skull. Literally drills a little hole in it. A spoon! Can I have the coin, please? Sorry. Oh, <gasps> that is so cool. No disinfectant, nothing. You show him a beast, and he'll tell you what it's thinking. <laughs> Back to work! Like putting a coin over top, though, right? Like to 
It's yeah, going to be like a, a little, metal plate, right? The surface yeah, of metal yeah. plate on your skull. That's so yeah. awesome. And they've been doing that yeah, since like ancient like Rome has been that method. Mm. Just like a little saw to like drill a hole and then put a plate on there. Yeah. Take out the skull fragments. Oh. The doctor told me you were fond of reading, so I, it has all of his major battles in it. I had the honor and privilege of serving with him. May I beg you to tell me what kind of man he is? You should read the book. Man, he looks so much better not having an infected arm. <laughs> <laughs> I just, yeah. Ooh. Immensely impressive anyone who chose to live this kind of life, but it also makes me think how shit on land life must be that this is the preferable choice. Mm. I mean, it might not be choice to be on this ship. It might be like the only work they could get, you know? Yeah, I mean, and that's part of yeah. just life being shit, right? Mm. Are you in the mood for that this is all there is. Oh my god. All right, Russell Crowe. Yeah, this is My awesome. ovaries are warming up. You have ovaries? <laughs> I'm more like Paul Bentney with the with the. Oh, that too, yeah. <laughs> Getting a kiss from the only woman around. <laughs> <laughs> it is Athena. Hmm. Wow, well done. Yeah, Mr. Lamb. That's <laughs> off. <laughs> oh my God, the blonde guy is from mm. the Vampire Diaries. Hmm. <laughs> But he's so young. Will here, he's seen her being built. In, in Boston, sir. He was getting married there. And his wife's second cousin, he works in the yard. I saw there was something right strange about her. And he described it to me and our nuptial per models. Wow, that's, that's awesome. amazing. An extra ration of rum for these men. Thank you very much, sir. That's great, having a blueprint. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the enemy ship. Or a model, rather. Now yeah. they just need to Love find that water. Death Star. <laughs> mm -hmm. Point where why she's so the fun. whole ship will explode. The weak point is that yeah. the word you're looking for. Thank you. Yes. Mm -hmm. Planking and framing like that would make a hull what two foot thick solid oak. To take her, she's out of our class. She's still vulnerable at the stern, like the rest of us. Did it turn personal for him because he didn't like being caught unaware like that? That's why he's so. Like I, don't I know, know his mission was supposed to take him out, but. <laughs> That's so cool. Just trading like this. Yeah. On water. A large man of war French stopped here on the 10th and then headed south. In three weeks ahead. Let us complete our business. I'm just going to say it. We need a hyper realistic naval game. Hmm. Put that woman down, Spain. <laughs> <laughs> Put that woman down, Slade. Slade. <laughs> what a name. To wives and to sweethearts. May they never meet. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Blakeney said that you served under Lord Nelson. Mr. Pullins was a sniveling midshipman. I have had the honor of dining with him twice. He always said in battle, just go straight at him. He's England's only hope if old Boney intends to invade. <laughs> old Boney. <laughs> the first time that he spoke to me, he leaned across the table and he said, may I trouble you for the salt? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not quite the story he was hoping for. <laughs> Second time he told me a story about how someone offered him a boat cloak on a cold night. His zeal for king and country kept him warm. I know it sounds absurd, but with Nelson, you felt your heart glow. He would seem to be the exception to the rule that authority corrupts. Do you see those two weevils, Doctor? Which would you choose? A weevil? Neither. If you had to choose. <laughs> Push me. Where's this going? Oh! Do you not know? One must always choose the lesser of two weevils. Oh. <laughs> 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 That's good. That is ridiculous. We're never gonna get a chance to say that one. We're, yeah, it's so specific to that so scenario. Like... <laughs> Lesser of two weevils. I was so confused because it was like uh, looking at food on a plate and then like talking about a weevil. I was like, what? <laughs> Get Pippin on there. Mm. Sing about Green Dragon. Got it backwards, though. Mm. We hope in a short time. <laughs> His voice is too pretty. Wonderfully true voice Mr. Holland possesses. <laughs> Come on, you bold young thoughtless man. Ah. Uh, they don't really like him, right? They don't really respect him because he's mm. so indecisive and panicky and... Yeah. Or maybe it's a classism thing? I don't know. Like, mm. like they are the the working group and... How did you get there? Wow, okay. Ooh. The bigger ship just keeps sneaking up on them. 
Mm-hmm. We'll have to bend every sail. Put up our pocket handkerchiefs if we have to. This is the second time he's done this to me. There will not be a third. Oh, yeah. He definitely... It's personal his, now. It's his e yeah, ego is involved for sure. The devil's in a wheel of that air phantom ship. What is it with this man? I kill a relative of his in battle, but he fights like you, Jack. Yeah, I'm trying to think. There wasn't anybody on IMDb that I was like, hey, that's another big actor that hasn't showed up yet. Mm. Not one that I'm aware of, at least. Bring the sun down to the horizon. The orb is no longer rising. It has reached its zenith. That would be noon. So that's noon. Uh, Six hours. Just keep us out of her reach until nightfall. Oh my god. <laughs> Kind of cool. I've never seen it like this. Like the the enemy is just this ominous, you know, just a ship. Like there's no face, there's no person really. Mm. Oh, that was a cool shot. Okay, they're getting really close now. Wouldn't want to lose you. Is it barrels of explosives or something? <laughs> no, I don't think so. They're sending. Oh, it's yeah, they're sending them away. Your it's a fake right back of the ship so the, the distance is off that's amazing <sighs> just jump in and swim back it's probably so cold like deathly cold and they send it that's so smart so yeah. not just the back but like follow like yeah yeah let that thing sail wherever so they chase the wrong thing that is so cool <clears throat> Mm-hmm. I guess it wasn't deathly cold. <laughs> now tell me that wasn't fun. <laughs> Unless they're turning around to fight. Well, yeah, they have to be behind them, right? Because that's where they're yeah. vulnerable, just like... Yeah, I thought he was just trying to get away, but he's going to fight. Okay. Oh, no, he is getting away. Okay, okay. Hmm. Stand the man down, Mr. Pullings. I'll take this watch. God, that is so awesome. Mm-hmm, that's a really good strategy. She's a right phantom, she is. Phantom or no, she's a private seer. Lucky Jack, I love her. Is she like a pirate? Oh, no. They can hunt down anything that bears our flag. Oh, he got the monkey. Do you know, Paul Wright, catching you to the cold. Pass it a coffee, too. <laughs> grumble, grumble, grumble. <laughs> <laughs> Set a course south, south, west. Aye, sir. Whoa. Okay, now they're behind. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Like a big U turn. <laughs> mm hmm. Set rolls and courses. It has to be more than a hundred sea miles, and he brings us up on his tail. My God, that shit. Just thought it'd be really funny if YouTube flagged us for the worst. <laughs> I thought of that too. <laughs> we'll have Stupid to bleep AI. them. We should bleep them just for funsies. <laughs> oh, it's very charming. It'd be lovely if they're not going into <laughs> yeah. high chance of death. Oh, almost tipped over. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's probably just riding the waves, right? But yeah, it looks yeah, yeah. really... Ooh. Oh, no! God, he could barely see anything. Ooh. I reckon he'd follow him to the gates of hell if he had to. Make your run to the hall, sir. Yeah, the ship's... Oh, oh my god! That's crazy! Closing on a top. I'll give up now. It does feel like Pippin is just on a ship. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, viewers, can you explain to me these uh, directional jargons? Like, I understand s southwest and blah blah blah, but like, what's why is it south southwest? South by southwest, it... I think... You asked viewers, I'll shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, if you know it, you know it. So, okay, so there's, like, north and west, and then there's northwest, and then there's... North by northwest is in between north and northwest. Okay. It's... yeah. Right? <laughs> Viewers can tell me if I'm completely bonkers. <laughs> oh, ship's falling apart. Okay. Someone's gonna fall. Yeah. I feel like it, some accident's gonna happen. The wind is like a monster! Oh, oh shit. shit! Oh, that's not good. Mr. Allen, and Swimming in such rough waters? Yeah. Impossible. <laughs> like... I can do it! Come on, 
That's so sad. Everyone's like, swim for the wreckage, and he's gonna get there and think he's safe, and then see that it's not attached anymore. Yeah. Oh, God. Wow. This is, like, you're actively killing one of your own. That's, that's, that's gonna be well, guilt. That's gonna be hard to get over. Yes. Yes. But it's, like, one or all, right? Well, I'm not saying they want to. I'm just saying yeah. the act of cutting it is... Totally. Yeah. Oh! Yeah. At least it's like the three of them, like the uh, the rest of the crew doesn't. Well, they, I don't know. They're gonna find out. Yes, but yeah. Because yeah. a lot of people were there, shouting. That's swim. true. So. Oh. And everyone already don't like him. Now they're gonna hate him, even though it's not really his fault. That's, yeah. Uh... There's no way he could have reached him at time. That young man was a casualty of war. As you said yourself, you have to choose the lesser of two evils. The crew will take it badly. Wally was popular. Am I speaking with my old friend or to the ship's captain? Well, as a friend, then. perhaps we should have turned back weeks ago. Therein lies the problem. You're not accustomed to defeat. Yeah, it's personal. Just a question of duty. Whatever the cost. Whatever the cost. My orders were to follow him as far as Brazil. I exceeded. Oh, shit. Yeah. So he. <laughs> <sighs> Completely unnecessary. Yeah. Shoot south. Shoot south, please, Mr. Bonder. Shoot south, sir. They're gonna hit Antarctica soon. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh, yeah, it's cold out there. Mm-hmm. Actually, yeah, really soon, because Cape Horn is, like, southern tip of South America. If they're not already there. We're headed back toward the sun. <laughs> to the sun! Prepare something special. Kill it! Kill it. <laughs> Our destination. It's the Galapagos Island. That's where the Akron will be. A slice what? of Albemarle? What is that? <laughs> it looks like jello. The Akron. For me. <laughs> Safe and sound at home again. Let the waters roar. <laughs> Look at the kid with this food around his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably drunk too. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to guess that Paul Bettany was a mm. spy. What? <laughs> I don't know. Lifelong spy? <laughs> yeah, just go to Galapagos and have a good time on the beach. Eat some giant island turtles. What? No. Yeah, apparently they were so delicious that even Darwin couldn't bring any back. <laughs> they kept eating it halfway through. Oh my god. The journey, because they were super delicious. They're said to be full of strange and wonderful beasts. You can wander at will, collecting bugs and beetles to your heart's content. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's a naturalist, yeah. Mm-hmm. Is this an insect? It doesn't look like one. It looks like a stick. Yes, that's the whole point. <laughs> See, is Paul Bettany See, disguising himself in order to survive? Disguises. <laughs> so we've raced the Galapagos! Man, after that, like, snow-covered ship mm -hmm. in, like, the wa like, cold water freezing your face and, like, all that, this yeah. must be so nice. Beaches. Sun. The movie said 1805, right? Mm -hmm. Something along those lines. So this is like 30 years before Darwin reached here. Disgusting. <laughs> Can't see any women. There's lots of ducks and lizards. <laughs> <laughs> those birds, they're a species of cormorant. See their underdeveloped oh. wings. Oh. Dragons don't seem to bother them. Um. Oh, dragons. Oh, look, there's one going for a swim. Iguanas don't swim. These ones do. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Paul Ben. What kind of naturalist are you? The birds don't fly and the iguanas swim. Well, I'll be damned. That's remarkable. No idea what's on the island. <laughs> what else? <laughs> yeah, two try this. <laughs> Tens of thousands. Yeah. Yeah, just do this for the rest of the movie. Stop fighting. <laughs> just look at crazy animals. I'd watch an entire, like, series or movie of people just, like, discovering animals. Someone else that fought the... Is it Acheon? Master the Albatross. Mm. God bless you. Albatross. We was coming back for fresh lines no more than a week ago. Crew prisoner, captain dead. Is that a course? West by south. Oh, they're not going to the island? Hmm. Tortoises would make very good eating. Mr. Mo yeah, there you go, tortoises. <laughs> hey, don't forget to check out our Patreon for these exclusives, and our merch link is in the description box below. And now, back to the movie. Oh, he came so close. He's got all geared up. 
Have you forgotten your promise? You're not an old conscience delay for the sake of an iguana or a giant peccary. You need to sail around it in order to continue your voyage. I could walk across it. Hmm. This is so sad. It's literally like a so chance I... of a lifetime. Yeah. You've forgotten yourself. We do not have time for your damned hobby, sir! I mean, I get it. But also, like, he could just walk across, right? Like, in the same amount of time? I is don't think so. unreasonable? <laughs> if they have to go all the way around, like, the the land? I, I don't know, and... but it's it's not. Yeah, no, I don't think so. But also, like, they're both wanting something that's basically solely for themselves. Because mm. they don't actually have to go chase the other ship. No. And they don't have to go on the island. Yeah. They're both just wanting something. I found a curious beetle walking on the deck. Oh. I think it's a Galapagos beetle. <laughs> you can have it, sir. Oh. That's really sweet. Thank you. Sir. Oh. He's just collecting. <laughs> we need to fire two broadsides to her one. Mr. Pulling, stop a battery! Mark your target! How deaf do you think these people are? Just being so I mean, close to cannons all oh. the time. Yeah, it's, I'm surprised they can hear orders yeah. being shouted at them. Just ruptured eardrums. Fire! <laughs> He's got <laughs> <laughs> tissues in his ears. <laughs> He's just trying to dissect a fish. <laughs> <laughs> Which is soused hog's face. My favorite. <laughs> hog's face. <laughs> I'd like to have some grog. What's the difference between grog and mead? I thought grog is made out of rum and some other things. It's like a mixed drink, isn't oh. it? Oh. Or is it just a general term for alcohol? Mead is specifically honey wine. Speaking of grog, I'm wearing a Strong Jaw Ale t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> so still. <laughs> yeah, no wind. Mm. Oh, they're just baking in the sun. Right. I'll gladly give it all up for the price of a cup of tea. I can't make it rain. Yeah, if you get your water from rain. And everyone's just baking in the sun, so you're yeah. just getting losing a lot of moisture too. It says unto him, for what caused the evil. It's from the Bible, the story of the Jonah. No, no, Joey knows a thing or two about evil. Oh god, is that gonna turn into superstition and then like a mm. witch hunt on board? Blaming somebody. Morning of the battle, he doesn't have the guts to beat to quarter. As soon as he went up the mizzen, Will falls. And whose watch was it when we lost out? Shit. Hmm. Yeah, everybody blames him. <laughs> Master at arms, take that man below and clap him in irons. Oh. Holy shit. This hollow man. man pushed past you without making his obedience, yet you said nothing. Why? I've tried to get to know the men, sir. They've taken a set against me. I'll set that to right, sir. I'll be much tougher on them from now on. They'll despise you in the end, think you're weak. You're what, 26? 30 next Friday. You failed to pass the lieutenant twice. You can't spend the rest of your life a midshipman. It's leadership they want, and you will earn their respect. After, like, observing him doing, like, everything else, like, or the, every, the opposite of that this whole time, yeah. Just, yeah. it takes a long time to, like, recover from that reputation, yeah. if, if at all. Uh-oh. Is Mr. Lamb a spy? There's no spy oh. on the ship. They mentioned, like, they're like, how did this ship find us? How did this ship know where we were going to be? But they didn't take anyone on for ages. And it's not like somebody can get on the radio and tell each other, so. No, but they did make a point of, like, being like, these letters are going out. Okay. I don't know. I, don't I mean, know. I could be wrong. Maybe there are spies. It just doesn't seem like it's possible. I can only afford one rebel on this ship. Do you think I want to flog Nagel? Ooh. Just from not saluting no, that guy for... when he walked by? No, no, he intentionally bumped and, into and him. And bumped it, yeah. He shoulder checked him. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna make everyone hate Hollem even more. 100%. Cut him down. Uh -oh. oh, God. Huh. Yeah, they're gonna do something to him. Yeah, this doesn't look good. This isn't good. Yeah, the salutes are now, like, it feels like. Mm hmm. It's not just mockery now, it's sinister. Like they're Yeah, gonna exactly. Do, they're gonna do something to him. <laughs> You've got like the younger kids like taking care of him. There's nothing physically wrong with him. He thinks he's being cursed. Yeah, they're gonna throw him overboard. He's causing it every time he's on watch. That ship appears. He's gonna take us all with it. Straight down to the up place. What's the the naval equivalent of cabin fever? I guess still cabin fever. <laughs> yeah, yeah, still the cabin. 
game was such a <laughs> sea <thought>. dementia. <laughs> <laughs> Ocean madness. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Captain thinks we'll get our win tomorrow. I'm sure of it. Oh, I think I know what he's gonna do. Oh. Oh man. You've always been very kind to me. Wow. And I guess you just, you hold your breath until you go, you get pulled down super deep, and then yeah. even if. That's insane. Because like oh even if you let God. the cannonball go, you don't wouldn't have enough time to get back up to the surface. Because I was trying to like figure out like how to do also, that. If, if you just if you want to anyways, you just because yeah. your instincts to live are so strong, right? So like, but if it's if you, I, I don't know, man, that's that's intense. Not all of us become the men we once hoped we might be. We failed him in respect of fellowship, and we ask for your forgiveness, Lord. They must feel so bad. Mm -hmm. And the wind comes and back. And then yeah. But that's how you that's how superstitions stick right yeah but it, it nobody thinks about the fact that you've just been here for like a few days and then yeah when it's but gonna also like Holland also believed that he was the jonah mm -hmm. like it's mm -hmm. oh oh and yeah had he just water. waited one night yeah but i guess if that superstition is already in people's mind it doesn't matter the next thing that goes wrong will be blamed on him again yeah because that's just how people are. Have you seen a bird that's following us? Yes, my bird. Oh no! Oh, why? <gasps> Doctor? No f***ing way! No way! Okay. Calumet. Side. Okay, it's a side. Side. A side. That's not Holy bad. Holy shit! But no one can treat him. He's the only one. Oh no! It's oh no! It's, it's pretty center. It's in the guts. The bullet took in a piece of shirt with it. <gasps> I'll manage. You'll see. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Always have Back all medics. Up. Everyone's a medic. Everyone is a deckhand and a medic. <laughs> she can't even look at the picture without feeling nauseous. We're not sure. Oh. We think it's Ursa. He doesn't care about that ship. I think it's just give him some something else to think about. I don't know. Mm. But the boy who is... Um, his arm was infected. As soon as they cut it off, he looked much better. So, like, maybe well, this guy will will be able cut, to get the cloth cut, and cut out his intestines. <laughs> well, no, like the, they're saying that it can get really infected because of the piece of cloth that got in there, right? Yeah, but I think because it's in his intestines, I mean, um, it's gonna go septic in his blood because yeah. everything's gonna, yeah, all the shit. Oh God. Oh, they went back to the <gasps> island. I just needed to stretch my legs. Oh. <gasps> yeah, no one would object to this. Like, likely every single person on this ship owes their lives to him at one point. Yeah. I do this with my own hand. <laughs> He's not Matt Damon on Mars. <laughs> He's uh, Paul Bettany on the Galapagos. <laughs> Put your hand on my belly. Team, please. Oh. Yeah, hold the mirror steady, dude. I guess we can just assume that the shot didn't go through puncture his intestines or something. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, even he's having a hard time watching. We'll have to raise a rib. What? Right and lift up. No. <sighs> he has to not pass out. Are you alright? <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, has to match it. She'll patch up nicely. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. Now stitch and hope for no infections. Yeah. Because nobody washed her hands. <laughs> <laughs> I like to think that when when he was like, she'll patch up nicely, he was talking about his shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Horrible. <laughs> <laughs> about me? Oh, you're f mate. <laughs> oh yeah, love cactus. Hmm. Won't they get super high? <laughs> <laughs> depends on it. <laughs> I guess, yeah, it depends on the cactus. The beetles each come with a specimen of the plant they were found on. <gasps> oh, I'm so glad he's all right. Mm hmm. <laughs> Perhaps I could be a sort of fighting naturalist. <laughs> Fighting naturalist. Really Look at that bear. I'm gonna punch it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> How long does the captain intend that we stay? Oh, a week perhaps. We shall head home before peace breaks out with France, God forbid. Name a shrub after me. Something <laughs> prickly and hard to eradicate. 
<laughs> Something prickly. <in> <laughs> <All right. laughs> That's great. That's lovely. <laughs> weird creatures yeah no fear because they never encounter people or mm. predators <laughs> <Arg. laughs> whoa oh, i want to go probably not allowed to just wander around like this anymore to protect the natural species but mm. <gasps> oh my gosh they're amazing are they real mm -hmm. those are real right yes <laughs> I, don't, I just don't know are they <gasps> real <laughs> What? I think we should be getting back. Oh hey. man, they're stealing all the animals. Oh, two of each. Mm. Oh God. Okay, it's been too pleasant for too I, long now. I have a theory. They're gonna get to the peak and see the other ship on the other side. Ooh. Good oh, call. Good call. As they crest the hill. Right? Am I right? I think so. The music cue is sounding like it. This looks CG. Very CG. <laughs> it's the same beetle. <laughs> Different ship, but French. I think that is the ship. I think that is the, That right? was the one? I think so. I, I couldn't okay. really tell. It's just. You must carry him. Put those down. Leave them. Open the cages. Oh. Oh, that's good that they opened. <laughs> war giveth and war taketh away. Let her have to some of these daughters Take her. We'd have to be bloody invisible. It does make sense that he wouldn't get the take any of those animals because that means this movie replaced darwin because <laughs> it's like three decades before so did you get to see your bird oh, my greatest discovery was your phantom and i did make one very interesting find oh it's a stick bug tell him about it mr Blake. <laughs> what are they going to disguise the ship as <laughs> yeah that, that, that he's got, yeah he's getting an idea i think i know i don't french flag you... oh Although I still, I feel like a false flag is probably an idea many have tried throughout the thousands and thousands of years of <laughs> naval battles. But they're they're painting everything and. Okay, okay, okay. So it's so, more than just a flag. Yeah, it's a change. Hiding okay. all their weapons. Okay. I just did, I didn't recognize. Like a... One has an appetite for whalers. Okay. Whaling ship. Okay. Yeah. You're the predator. <laughs> did they actually shoot this at like night? <laughs> It looks like it. Like it looks really. It's so grainy that it yeah. looks like yeah, the ISO is super high. Or well, it's probably just film grain, but still. Oh, uh, they're making it look like a damaged yeah, ship yeah. too. Yeah. Oh, that's good. And a bunch of joints. <laughs> <laughs> Fat I ones. I don't think that's what that was. <laughs> Unship your rear wheels. Amazing. I got that idea from a stick insect. Wait till he finds out about the angler fish. Come on, kill it, you two, get dressed. <laughs> no sirs, no salutes, no whistles, no bells. All right, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's lots of funny moments in this movie. Yeah. I like it. You may well turn the tide. Indeed, sir. That's so smart. Yeah. Make a show of fleeing, panicky and disorganized, like a whaler might. <laughs> Just thinking of Team America waving the hand. <laughs> what? Team America, what's your signal? Are you in danger? And then they just silently wave his arms around. <laughs> Do you remember that? <laughs> no. Congratulations, Peter. You're to be stationed on the quarter deck. Come off onto a broad reach. Make a bad show of keeping you caught. <laughs> we'll lead your gun crew, and then when we board, you'll take command of the ship from here on the quarter deck. Back to your station. Sir. Stop saying sir. Yeah. Stop it, right off. That's a bad sheet, Dave. We must bring him right up beside us before we spring this trap. The Acheron is a tough nut to crack, and they will sell their lives dearly. Till the signal calls you to spill the wind from our sail. You must run out and tie down in double quick time. There will be no chance to reload. It gives you one shot from the larboard battery. Jesus. <laughs> England is under threat of invasion, and though we be on the far side of the world, this ship is our home. Far side of the world. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, you're in you're already dead. dead. Hello, Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> three lumps in there. <laughs> the the ship's cook is Loki, one of the best characters. Yeah. Just grumbly. <laughs> yeah. But then he's a sweetheart. Yeah. They like gave him more sugar. Oh my god. Oh my go. god. We're seeing some people. <gasps> Warning shots. Yeah, flew they... right past. Yeah, it so they're just, just... Hit them immediately. Yeah. So it was a. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, like we're, we're boarding. Yeah. Yeah. This is your last warning. Let's 
I feel like they could have just not raised a flag and just start shooting immediately. Yeah, hundred percent. But it was the you know. Yeah. A little God extra. Save the king. Yeah. Come on, come on. One shot. Yes, get. Do not miss your chance to blow. <laughs> this opportunity comes once in a lifetime. <laughs> you better. Do we continue? <laughs> no. No. Big mast, fall down. Come on. Yes. Hey. Yes. Sacre bleu. <laughs> oh yeah, they're gonna spin around and shoot the other side. Yee -hee. Oh, ho, ho, ho. God, is cannons are insane. It really is just let's throw this lump of metal at them. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Grappling hooks away. <laughs> oh, there's no one here. They're faking it. Ambush and ambush. Yeah. Maybe stab a few of the people on the ground. No. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. headshot. Oh, Billy. Oh. Just such chaos. Even with the armbands, yeah. it's so hard to tell who's who. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Like, I don't even know who's getting hurt, aside from nope. actors that I can recognize, you know? I don't know who, which side is getting killed. We can't see who's who, but they made a point of putting armbands right yeah, on, yeah, yeah. right? So, like, I'm just saying, hopefully... in the chaos, it'll be so hard to oh, see. Oh, totally. To pay I feel that way about, band. like, all fighting <laughs> with, like, big groups of people. Yeah, ancient warfare. When, I, I mean, I guess that's probably why uniforms exist. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay, I need to see Russell Crowe Crow do another triple punch like he did in Gladiator. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Yes. Yes. <laughs> More people to help. <laughs> but they don't have armbands. <laughs> Just shout English the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Just nicked him. Yeah. Look at it mm. I like that he didn't kill him. It's like the mm -hmm. battle's over. They won. Oh. They're a doctor, yeah. Is that their captain? Dr. Deligny, monsieur. The doctor. The guy in the door said doctor. No, on no, on the table. Oh, oh, yeah. Before the captain died, he said I was to give you this. Yeah. And him, yeah. Yep. Celebrated too early. No. I'll do it. Oh my god. Can you help me? Oh! I can be calm. I will be done. He does not have to temptation. We therefore commit their bodies to the deep to be turned into corruption. Whew. It's our old friend. It's still alive. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still thinking about name a shrub after me something prickly <laughs> hard to eradicate. <laughs> it is so much bigger too, the ship. Like Yeah. <laughs> Re repainting it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you don't get attacked by another pirate ship. Yeah. <laughs> thinking thinking that you're I think I shall return to the Galapagos. You, however, shall take the Acheron south to Valparaiso. Mr. Hogg would be a good choice for sailing master Oh, he's making him captain. Amazing. Your orders. <gasps> Good luck to you. Thank you, Doctor. Good luck, Tom. See you in Portsmouth. Oh my god, everyone is so genuine and lovely. <laughs> mm. It's really nice. <laughs> Kill it there. Which it will be ready when it's ready. <laughs> <laughs> I met that doctor. I spoke to him. No, he died a fever months ago. <gasps> that was the captain. Holy shit. Oh my god, I thought the movie was over. Holy shit. They dressed <laughs> they dressed a corpse. Mr. Moet to the great cabin. Oh my god. Change of course. Southeast by east. It's not over. He'll never get to go back to Galapagos. <laughs> I saw. Southeast by east. Wow. I mean, they need to go because they, the yeah, yeah, yeah. is in danger. Yep, yeah, 100%. If not dead already. The bird's flightless. It's not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. <laughs> Does it just okay. end? I'm assuming that they It's just the one captain Everyone else is in like lockup, right? Like they only have to deal with one guy Maybe Actually yeah. the, the one guy might be in lockup too 
Like the doc, their doctor. Sorry, the captain that's uh, that's Sage's yeah, yeah, doctor. Yeah. That's probably locked up with the rest of. Okay, so they're back at it again. <laughs> I love this so much. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, he didn't for once question it that the doctor was the captain. But I mean, I don't know why he would, yeah. Well, when I saw the dead captain, I was more concerned with like, is he going to be okay with it ending like this? Like him not getting to get mm. the captain. Oh. I, was, I, was, I was even about to commend the captain of the Ar Archeon for like... <laughs> giving him know, a sword. Admitting defeat. Yeah, totally. <laughs> oh. Wow. I love that so much. There were so many like twists and turns and surprises. Yeah. Like yeah. up until the last minute. Yeah. The Harlem oh. thing is the, the, just the tragic part. Nothing but stupid superstition. Our introduction to him was that he was a panicky, it's true. undecisive yeah, he, guy. He, and fair yeah. enough. That's a fair criticism, especially you shouldn't put someone like that in charge. But yeah. he's also learning. He's just like an older but, student, essentially, among that group. But he is not very good at it. Exactly. That's the thing. Is like when we found out that he was 30, it really was like, maybe this isn't for you. I'm assuming he's probably somewhere in like upper society. That's why he gets to have these kind of roles and training. Totally. Yeah. Which so means that be... he probably has like family pressure, though. Like Family pressure, but also the the privilege of maybe he could go another way. Maybe, he yeah. He doesn't I don't know. have yeah. to be on this ship. He could yeah. maybe have yeah. done like, something when else. Yeah. Like, when they first show signs of the crew disgruntled towards him, I thought they were going to go the route of he got that position sheerly out of, nepotism? like, essentially nepotism. Yeah, that's why people don't like him, and that he's just like a, you know, like a posh mm. asshole. But he's not. Yeah. He's like a super nice guy. He's really he's, nice. He's just... He's, he's trying yeah. his best, yeah. but his best is just not that good. I think the other issue with it is that he's very timid. But like being timid in this world is cowardice. Yeah. And there's just no room for that because it kills other people when, you do, when you're, when you're yeah. like that in this world. So I get the disdain towards him, but I just wish it wasn't superstition that drove him yeah. to his end. And that he believed it himself. Yeah, it's heartbreaking. Yeah. I did not think I was going to like this movie when I was like, oh, it's about a ship. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I honestly thought it was going to be so boring and I was, I'm so wrong. This was so good. Yeah, this it was, was a really good movie. Like every second of it. And also they had, they made room for these amazing moments with these characters. At the end, when Tom got his, like was made captain, I just cared so much. <laughs> like it was, it's insane. I should and, also point oh. out, this director, Peter Weir, I'm just looking at his IMDb right now. The movie mm. he did just before this is The Truman Show. <gasps> no way! Yeah, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't two realize. great movies back to back. Cool. <sighs> I, that's it? We're done? Yeah, it's a great movie. That's it. I don't have anything else to say. Do you? Say, uh, no. I, yeah. I said my piece. This yeah, movie rocks. Yeah, let's go watch The Wire. Okay. Uh, that's a wrap on this episode of Cinepinch. Thanks, everyone, for joining us. I yeah, don't know like what to I'm doing our, uh, <laughs> thank our patrons for helping us keep doing this. And shout out to Ava Dandy, yes. in Charge, a.k.a. Ada Baron, uh, Always Dead, Arabian Prince, uh, Bacon Narwhal 310, Bandit 5 by 5 Ben AM, Blips, uh, Brendan Meng, Chase Lonergan, Trenor Alpha, Christopher B. Swanson, uh, Cine, Golden, Cine Golden Bed, <laughs> <laughs> Crow, nice. uh, The Big Appa, Dan Weeks, and uh, Dave Atcha. Thank you all thank very much. Thank you guys so much. Bye.